1933 Hamiltonian is probably known for the $50,000 stumble. What do we mean by the $50,000 stumble? Well, Fred Egan had a trotter entered by the name of Brown Barry, and he won the first heat pretty decisively. And he got beat the next heat, but he's going to win the third heat, and he stumbled, and you'll see it on the film. The winner, Ben White, driving Mary Reynolds. That's right. It was the first winner for Mr. Reynolds, and he was treasurer of the Hamiltonian Society that, at that time. And this was during the Depression, and somehow somebody absconded with some of the money, and he didn't get all the purse that he won, and he was treasurer. <laughs> The 1933 Hamiltonian carried a purse of $40,000. The winning time, 203 and 3 fourths. The winner will be Mary Reynolds, driven by Ben White. We want you to pay a special close attention to the horse along the rail as they're coming down the stretch for the finish. That'll be Brown Barry, the driver Fred Egan, falling to the ground and getting right back up and finishing the mile, but losing the big race. Let's take a look. The 1933 Hamiltonian. Racing at Goshen on the mile track. Brownberry and Fred Egan will make kind of a break or stumble coming down the lane. That's right. I'm sure now that uh, Mary Reynolds had won the first heat, but Fred Egan told me he's going to win it easily. There it goes. There the horse down, jumps right back up to finish the mile. But the winner is Mary Reynolds with Ben White driving 203 and three quarters. Mary Reynolds in the 33 Hamiltonian.